Salvete omnes. Welcome to this uh, video lesson on Colloquium Wicesimum, the 20th dialogue that goes along with Lingua Latina per se illustrata. Uh, hic in pictura es Diodorus, Diodorus Magister est. Hic in pictura es servus, es servus nomine Tlepolemus. Tlepolemus es servus Diodori. Et hic in mensa as kibus et hic es poculum. Ah, personae in colloquio, Diodorus, Tlepolemus, Simacus. Characters, Diodorus, Tlepolemus, and Simacus. And Simacus is the name of the doctor. Simacus est medicus. Diodorus, Ludi Magister, Diodorus, the teacher of the school, qui laetatur discipulos improbus iam abesse, who is happy that the wicked students, the bad students, are now absent, sum Tlepolemum servum mucat, calls his own slave Tlepolemus. Tlepolemus intrans, Tlepolemus entering, Silentium Domini Animadvertit uh, notices the silence of his master. Notice Domini in the genitive here. I should say introns with the NS ending. That's the nominative ending for a present participle. Uh, our word present comes from Prisens Prisentus, which is one of these. And English present participles always have ing, so entering here. Um, one other thing. So... Um, Two new characters name in this names in this colloquium. Simicus is the doctor. You might remember him from an earlier chapter in the book, but he wasn't named there. Uh, so from the name Simicus, which actually means um, sort of fighter together with, so like fellow fighter. The sim part is from the Greek sin, uh, which means with or together with, and the makus part is coming from the mock root, which has to do with battles and fighting. Uh, and then the name of the slave of Diodorus here. Yes, Diodorus, he's not really wealthy, but he is. He does have enough money to own one slave. And his slave is also Greek, or at least his name is Greek. The name Tlepolemus is from two Greek roots. Tle, meaning enduring or bearing, and Polemus, meaning war. So one who endures war. Um, it's kind of a shortened version of ne. Ptolemus. Neoptolemus is um, kind of new war person, um, very similar rooted name, and that was the name or one of the names given to the son of Achilles. All right, well, back to our story. So, enduring of the war and fighter with person, <laughs> these are their names in Greek, but basically the names as daughters just tell us that these people are Greek ethnically. All right, so back to the story. He notices the silence of his master, eumque interrogat, and he asks him, Walesne, Domini? Are you well? Are you healthy, uh, master? Diodorus, Diodorus says, Non recte valeo, I am not really well. Now, recte literally means sort of correctly or directly. I am not rightly well. <laughs> Tlepolemus, he says, and notice here it's in the vocative with the short e instead of the us ending. Fesusum, I am tired. Caput dolet, my head is hurting. Ed brachium dextrum, and my right arm, and you can understand, is hurting. And Tlepolemus says, Cur medicum non adis, why do you not go to the doctor? And then Diodorus says, Medicus stultus says, the doctor is stupid. Ipse melius me sanare posum. I myself, ipse, am able, posum, uh, to cure myself better, uh, to heal myself better. Primum ese et bibere volo. First, I want to eat. Notice the long mark on ese, not ese to be, but ese to eat. And to drink. I want first to eat and drink. Tum dormire, then to sleep. Afer mihi kibum, bring me food. 
exit Tlepolemos. Tlepolemos goes out. Paulo post a little bit later. So Paulo um, is related to Paulum, meaning a little bit. This is the ablative case here. Uh, and it's related to Parwus and also the English name Paul, which is from Paulus, meaning little person, at least etymologically in Latin. A little bit later, Paulo post. Panem et duos pisces et poculum aquae plenum domino afert. Uh, a little bit later, he brings or carries to afert. He brings bread and two fishes and a cup full of water to his master. Notice the master is in the dative case to the master. Diodorus aquamedins, Diodorus seeing. Notice the present participle with the ns again. Seeing the water, says, inquit, quid, what, aquamne mihi affairs, you're bringing me water? I can't believe this. All right, the na on the end, of course, is just the yes, no question. Tlepolema says, meridie aquam bibre oportet. Oportet is, it is fitting, it is proper, it's about sort of social necessity. So it's proper, it's fitting, it's necessary in this context to drink water at noon, at midday. And Diodorus says, Servo soportet aquam bibere. It is fitting, it's proper for slaves to drink water. Ego non aquam. Sed vinum bibere volo. I do not want uh, to drink bibere, water, but wine. All right, and Tlepolemus says, Sine pecunia, vinum tibi emere non possum. Without money, I am not able to buy wine for you. Nec tu mihi ulam pecuniam das. Nor are you giving me any money. Okay, so he's like, okay, master, if you want me to give you some wine to drink, you're going to have to give me some money to buy the wine. Diodorus saculum numorum plenum. Servo ostendit. Diodorus shows a little pouch, a little bag, soculum, full of coins. Numorum is the genitive plural. To the slave, dative case. Atque hodie inquit numos habeo. And today he says, I have coins. Nis kisne kalindas unias esse hodie? Do you not know that it's the calends of June today? Calendis merke de macipio a discipulis. On the calends, the first day of the month is what the calends is. On the calends, I receive my pay, um, my fee, from the students. Yam bonum winum ebre possum. Now I am able to buy good wine. Bonum winum. And Tlepolemus says, Ego ad tebernam ibo. I will go to the shop. Vinumque tibi imam. And I will buy wine for you. So notice here we've got the bo bi bu future and we've got the a and e type future here. Uh, M O emory is a third conjugation, so that's the a. And then um, a o uses the bo bi bu. I will go to the shop and I will buy wine for you. And Diodora says, Bene facies, you will do well. All right, in other words, that's a good thing for you to do. Eke pecunia, look, money. So he's going to hold out the money to his slave there. Magister servo suo denarium dat. The teacher gives a denarius, this is a uh, silver coin, to his slave. Servus ad ostium versus gradum facit. The slave makes a step. Gradus. That's related to gradior, the, the verb that means to walk or step. So gradus is, um, is a noun, though, here. So he makes a step towards ad versus the door, ostium. Cum Diodorus mane inquit, nole abire. When Diodorus says, Wait, stay, don't go away. Ipse ad tabernam ibo. I myself will go to the shop. 
Okay, so he seems to have changed his mind here. He was going to get his slave to go out and buy the wine for him. Now he is telling him to stop. He's going to go himself. And Tlepolema says, Wisne me te kumunire. Do you want, Wisne, me to come with you? Te kum. Ego winum feram. I will carry. Notice again the future, the om ending for I future here. I will carry the wine. And Diodorus says, Wolo te hik manere. I want you to stay here. Winum e taberna non feram. I will not carry the wine from the shop. Said ilik bibam, but I will drink it there. Rede mihi numum. Return the coin to me. Servus domino denarium redins. The slave returning. Notice again the present participle. Returning the denarius to this master. Inquit says, Paulum bibe. Drink a little bit. We might say drink only a little. Cura corpus tuum. Take care of your body. In other words, don't drink and get drunk and be unhealthy. Tu officium tuum cura. You take care of your own business, okay? Mind your own business, we might say in English. Inquit Diodorus, says Diodorus. Non medicus, said servus meus es. You are not a doctor, medicus, but my slave. And Tlepolemus says, Quid vis me facere? What do you want me to do? All right. Magister epistulam promit. The teacher takes out the letter. Atque hanc epistulam inquit. Volo te ad lucium julium balbum fere. Um, he says, I want you to carry, fere, this letter, hanc epistulam, to Lucius Julius Balbus. And Tlepolemus says, Ubi habitat ille. Where does that guy live? Where does he live? Aspice per hanc fenestram. Look through this window. Inquit Theodorus, says Diodorus. Videsne illum montem. Do you see that mountain? Tlepolemus per fenestram apertam montem albanum aspicit. Tlepolemus looks at the Alban Mount or um, Alban Hill through the open window. You could say Alban Mountain if you want. Inter Tusculum et Montem Albanum parva valis interes. In between Tusculum and the Alban Mount or the Alban Hill, those are the usual ways we call it in English, there is a small valley. Video inquit Tlepolemus, I see, says Tlepolemus, es Mont Albanus, it is the Alban Mount. Um, Deodorus says, Villa Julii sub illo monte sita est, the villa of Julius, notice the genitive, is situated or located under that hill or mountain. It's not really a big mountain, that's why we tend to say hill here. Ne quero ab hoc loco kerne potes, nor indeed can it be seen, is it able to be seen, kerne is a synonym for wideri, from this place. Said ecce, but look, via angusta quae ad vilam fert. A narrow road, via angusta, which leads to the villa. So a narrow road, so he means it, it's a smallish sort of a, a road, not a big main public thoroughfare. Age, discede. Come on, leave, depart. Tlepolemus then says, Quid est in epistula? What is in the letter? And Diodorus says, Nihil ad te serve. Nothing to you, slave, or nothing for you, slave. It's so like, in other words, mind your own business. It's not your, your stuff to worry about. Modo fac officium tuum. Just do your duty. Vale. Bye. Tlepolemus discate it. Tlepolemus leaves. Epistula magistri ferens. Carrying. Notice the present participle again. The letter of the teacher. 
Solus Diodorus Panem et Pisces est. Alone Diodorus eats, notice the long E makes it eats instead of is, eats the bread and the fishes. Um, atque Paulum aquae bibit, and he drinks a little bit of water. Hodie atem, today, however, quam quam festus est, although he is tired. Post cubum non dormit, after his food he does not sleep. All right, and then we can see a little picture here. This is Diodorus going out ad tabernam to the shop. And I believe this figure here, who is already drinking, is Simicus Medicus. All right. Said statim domo exit, but immediately he leaves the house or goes out of the house. Magister viam angustam intrat, the teacher uh, enters a narrow road. Ubi tabernam obscurum adit where he goes to a dark tavern or shop. Ea taberna plena est, hominum bibintium. That shop is full of bibintium hominum, drinking people. Qui inter se colocuntur, who are talking, conversing, between themselves. Now, this is how you say to each other in Latin. Um, Latin doesn't have a reciprocal pronoun. That's a pronoun like each other or one, one another. So you have to say who are talking between themselves. <laughs> Alei clamant, some of them are shouting, ridentque, and are laughing. Alei canunt, others are singing. Yam diodorus quoque e magno puculo vinum bibit. Now Diodorus also drinks from, or drinks wine, weenum, from a big cup. Dum colocutur cum amicis, while he is speaking with his friends. Salve, ludi magister, inquit unus e bebentibus. Hello, school teacher, or literally teacher of the school, says one of those drinking, one of the ones drinking. Bebentibus, again, just like bibentium up here is a present participle, this is the genitive plural, bibentium, and then this is the ablative plural, bibentibus. Diodorus poculum tolens, diodorus, lifting up or right, raising his cup, inquit says, et tu salve, Simeke, and hello to you, Simicus. And then Simicus, the doctor, says, Quidagis, what are you doing? How are you doing? Puros non doces, you're not teaching the boys. And Diodorus says, Quid tu, medice, what about you, doctor? Aigros non curas, you're not curing or taking care of the sick. All right, so he's like, you tell me I should be teaching? Well, I'm going to tell you, you ought to be curing somebody. So in other words, he was kind of taking this as a sore point. Simicus, the doctor says, Hoc omni tempore pauci sunt agri. At this time of the year, few are sick. And Diodorus says, Mihi sunt pauci discipuli. For me, there are few students. Now, this is that date of a possession that we often get. Uh, in Latin, you can say quid. Um, quid to be nominus, what to you the name is, and then a person will say, mihi nominus, to me the name is. But it's like, my name is, or I have the name X, um, so it shows possession. So to me, there are few students, meaning I have few students. Quos meridie domum remito, which at noon I send home. Neque eos post meridiem revenire jubeo nor do I bid or order them to return after noon. Sex horas puros tocere satis est mihi. It's enough, satis est, for me to teach boys for six hours. Okay, so this is from dawn until noon. So um, those are the first six hours of the Roman day. Nunquero vinum bibrevolo. But now I want to drink wine. 
And Symmachus says, Meridie non vinum sed aquam bibere oportet. At noon, it's not fitting to drink wine, but water. And Diodorus says, Cur non lac bibere me ubes medicae? Why don't you order me to drink milk, doctor? Ut parvulum infantum, as a little bitty baby. So the point he's making here is, you're telling me not to drink? Come on, I am not a little baby. And Simica says, Si we sanus vivere, paulum vini bibe. If you want to live healthy, drink a little bit of wine. Cura corpus tuum, take care of your body. Diodorus then says, Simper me paulum bibre you base. You're always ordering me to drink a little bit. Said ipse plura pocula bibis quam ego. But you yourself, ipse, drink more cups, plura pocula, than I do, quam ego. <laughs> and Simica says, Ego recte valeo. I am rightly well. I am, you know, in good health, we could say idiomatically in English. I'm in very good health, recte valeo. Nec plus bibo, nor do I drink more, quam opus est, than there is need. So opus est is um, kind of a synonym for nekeseas. I don't drink any more than is necessary. Te autem, male vi valere video, diodore. Um, Diodorus, I see that you, however, are in bad health. Male valere. And, all right, ac, medicus tu sum, I'm your doctor. And Diodorus replies to this, Ego satis bene valeo. I am well enough. Quam quam thesusum, although I am tired, atque caput mihi dolet, and my head is hurting. Okay, well that gets us down to the bottom of our third page. Uh, we'll pick up in another video lesson to finish up this colloquium. I hope you learned a few things here, um, a few things about Latin, and maybe a few things about the doctor and the teacher here. Walete omnes!